Today on Blog Success Journal, we're going to talk about pay per click and other good advertising methods for your blog. Okay, the first one, pay per click, obviously. We're talking, you know, Google AdSense. That's the most common one, right? So basically, you put a little piece of code on your site, someone clicks on an ad, you get paid. That's how it works. It's very simple, and other people who have products or services that they're trying to advertise will bid on these ads. And if you have a website that's in a very high profile niche, like, I don't know, home loans or, you know, vitamins or something, something that makes a lot of money, people can often bid one, two, three dollars per click on your site, and you get a portion of that. Bigger breasts, erectile dysfunction, losing weight. Yeah, the really competitive stuff. Yeah. Crazy competitive. Some of those are insanely competitive. I will tell you, Google AdSense is very prudish, though. So if you have another site like our Ask Dan and Jennifer site, which is in the love and sex niche, good luck. Because uh, they, they don't like you talking about sex. No, no. Nope. Sex is bad. It can be really prudes. bad. <laughs> prudes. Total prudes. You only have sex in the dark. The really kinky stuff behind closed doors. All right. Email marketing. Uh, rent. You can That's rent. That's sexy. <laughs> That's very sexy. You can get off on that. All right. You can rent other people's lists, but better yet, Build your own, that, that's, especially with all spam uh, laws, et cetera. You want to build your own list. It's, build your list, build your brand. It's a very, very valuable thing. Exactly. And that's kind of the lesson, the rule that we follow, and we strongly encourage you to follow that. Now, as far as getting them to sign up on your list, offer them something enticing, a report, something. A report, nobody wants a report, nobody wants a newsletter. They want something really valuable to what they're searching for, what they need. That solves their problem. Exactly. Um, the me now, when you're sending a message, it should be short, concise, personalized, whenever possible. Add video. If you can share videos, people love videos, especially mm -hmm. funny cat videos. Uh, you can use a software, uh, a service. It's sort of a software, but it's a managed service like Aweber that we use to automate and manage your campaign. Because you can't just send an email to lots of people from your email, from your desktop from your email client. It's not going to No, work. if your email list is more than a few hundred, you, it's just, your emails are never going to get out. They're never going to get Even delivered. Even if he doesn't, yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, and it's certainly not sustainable. And don't forget, offer a product or service in your messages. You want to. Don't monetize. forget to sell things. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Monetize that stuff. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, as long as you're providing, providing good free information along with the promotion, people are fine with that. They expect it. It's everywhere. Yeah, if you look at a site and it has no ads, you're like, huh, that's kind of weird. Hmm, what's wrong with the site? Yeah. yeah. Okay, the third one, affiliate marketing. Okay, if you're not doing this, you should be. There are tons of people out there looking like places like ClickBank or Commission Junction or Google for people who are willing to give you a portion of the sales if you promote their product. It's really that simple. But you want to find people in your niche with, that are reputable. Okay, don't just promote anybody's product. You want to make sure that they have a reputable product. They're willing to stand behind it and back it up. Yeah, absolutely.